Welcome to the WordPress Photography Podcast, the podcast for photographers who want to learn how to get the most out of WordPress to grow their photography business. You don't need to be a geek to understand WordPress. Settle back and listen as we show you how. Now, here's your host, Scott Wyden Kivowitz. Welcome to episode 66. My name is Scott Wyden Kivowitz, and today I'm joined by my friend Jamie Swanson. Uh, I am very happy to have you on the show. Uh, I've been wanting to get you on for a while, and uh, timing has worked out, which is good. Um, so, Jamie is a former wedding photographer and now a personal brand photographer, the founder of the Modern Targ, and personal brand photography. Jamie has an immense amount of tools and resources available for, for photographers from starting a business to setting prices, getting more clients and so much more. Um, I think I first met Jamie through the modern tog, which has evolved dramatically over the years. Um, <laughs> so it's, it's, yeah, it's been a joy to see uh, all the changes and, and, and why not to go th- to come, come around uh, through both the modern talk and everything that you've done. Um, Jamie teaches through her blog, online courses, inside her Facebook groups, and she's a wealth of photography business knowledge. And I'm really looking forward to this conversation. This is a topic that we have not discussed yet on the podcast. Ooh. So um, I'm really excited for it because this is also a, a, a genre of photography. Personal brand photography is a genre of photography I've been really wanting to explore because there's not really many or any people in my area doing it. <laughs> and I feel like it would be the perfect time to completely change niches and getting and get into that. But so this will be a good conversation. Welcome to the show, Jamie. Thank you. I'm so excited to be here. And I'm glad that everything finally aligned for us to do this because we have been trying to do it for ages. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, so before we get into what's going on with you, with uh, with the with the new endeavor and with whatever you want to share, I just want to say, uh, so typically we have a, a, a section right now that's like WordPress photography related news. I don't have any news to share except that uh, this is the last episode for the summer. Uh, my plan was to do the last episode in uh, June, but uh, timing the way the timing worked out to get this episode in, I just extended a little bit. So there will be a break for the podcast after this episode, and it, I'll probably be back in September, maybe the beginning of October, or right around Photo Plus Expo. I don't really know, um, but uh, you know, man's got to take a break from doing the same thing every so often so um, enjoy your summer scott <laughs> yeah 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 gotta take a little bit of time off from the podcast i got so much other stuff i gotta worry about um mm-hmm. so <laughs> what's going on with you oh boy scott loaded question so this year has been a blur because um i have basically i feel like i'm restarting my business i've been right. running the modern talk since 2011 um, did wedding photography for many years. Um, and, you know, you and I both know that a successful business really has a specialty. You niche down into something. And right. when I started the Modern Cog, I was one of the few people only focusing on the business side of photography. But now in 2018, there's like a million people focusing on the business side of photography. And it's not niche anymore. It's very generic. And so I had to... Uh, I basically realized that I wanted to reinvent what I was doing with the Modern Tog. And last December, um, can I share a little bit of my story on how I discovered personal brand yeah. photography? Awesome. So I, um, I realized that even though I've spent the last seven years growing my business brand with the Modern Tog, which has gone very well, I wanted to have more of a personal brand because eventually I want to be working more with entrepreneurs as well. And so to do that, I need to have an audience in the entrepreneurial space because I've got it here in the photography space, but not there. And so I'm like, okay, well, I need photos. I need, you know, if I'm going to grow an Instagram account or whatever else, I need to have lots of photos for this. And yes, I can take selfies. Yes, my husband can do some of me, but I really wanted somebody to come in who understood what I needed to grow a personal brand and to run my business online. And so I went looking for a photographer who could do that for me because it's just so much easier to do a shoot and have all the images ready to go. 
And I was shocked at what I found. I think it was the end of November or early December. But I, I mean, there's, we both know, and everyone listening here who's a photographer knows, there are tons of photographers out there who 